So congratulations, hopefully you're watching this video because you just got your first sale on Shopify and now you're wondering how the heck do you ship that product out to your customer? And if you haven't got your first sale yet but you want to be prepared for when you do, well, you're still welcome here. Welcome to my channel. My name is Baird and this is Baird Business. And in today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can fulfill your first order on Shopify and get it delivered to your customer. This is going to be a quick how-to video guide for beginners. So if you already know how to ship out your orders, keep an eye out on my channel because I'll be posting a new video in the next couple days. So first things first, you're going to need to have three things. One, the DSers app installed to your Shopify store. Two, an AliExpress account. And three, the DSers Google Chrome extension installed. Having these three things makes the entire process so much easier. So if you don't have an AliExpress account, account or you haven't installed DSers onto your Shopify store or installed the Google Chrome extension, pause this video really quickly, open a new tab and do that and then come back to this video. But if you have that, then we're good to go. DSers is the app that we're going to use to connect our Shopify store to our AliExpress account to ship our customers their products. This is all very simple and easy to follow. Also, if you have any questions whatsoever, please comment them down below and I'll be responding to every single comment and question. Now, if you added your product to your Shopify store through the DSers app, this process is going to be much easier. But if you added the product manually through the Shopify product tab, then we just need to sync the product to the DSers app. It takes no time and I'm going to show you really quickly while I'm doing this, just in case those who don't have the product set up through DSers can follow along. Now that we covered that, let me hop into my computer and let's get started. You can see on my Shopify store, I have one product right here, the Spine Deck. This is the product I'm going to be showing you. I added this manually through my products tab, so we need to sync this product to the DSers app and get these orders shipped out. I've gone ahead and created some test orders that need to be fulfilled to walk you through the process. So let me go to the DSers app right here, click on apps, DSers, and we will sync the product and our orders to the store. So we're going to go over here to the My Products tab. You can see that there are no products on the DSers app, so nothing is synced as of yet, but we just need to click on Import Shopify Products, and we can see our product right here. Let's select that and then click on Import. And then boom, we have a green check right here. We can exit out of that, and we have our product mapped to our DSers app. Now what we need to do is connect the app to AliExpress so we can ship out these products. So in another tab, I have the AliExpress URL for the product open. I'm going to copy the URL right here on top of the page. I'm going to go back to the DSers app and click this button right here, the variance mapping button. Click on marketplaces. And we're going to click on standard. We're not gonna do basic, we're gonna do standard because we have multiple variants, different colors, we have blue and purple. So I'm going to click on standard, I'm going to turn it on, confirm. And right here for blue, I'm going to paste the URL of the product, paste on AliExpress. And I'm going to click this little arrow key right here. And I'm going to select blue because that's the blue color variant, submit. And I'm going to do the same thing for the purple variant. Click on purple, submit, save. And we have successfully synced our product. So you can see right here, it is connected to AliExpress. So I forgot I already fulfilled those three orders. So I created a new test order to show you how it works. If we go to the open orders, you'll see we now have one order awaiting to be shipped. And this is the order that has not been fulfilled yet. The other orders have been fulfilled. You can see right here, fulfilled. This is where they will go once the order is shipped out. But we have to take care of this one right now. Now you can see right here, it says there's no shipping method applied to this order. Don't worry about that error right there. We're going to select our shipping method right here. So we're gonna scroll down and click on shipping method. And these are all the shipping methods that the supplier in AliExpress offers. You can see that these are really expensive, $64, $59. Nobody's gonna pay that much, it's way too expensive. So we're going to use the AliExpress standard shipping. You can see right here, it takes 22 days, which is a long time, but it's not the end of the world. But I would seriously recommend you do not use AliExpress for longer than you absolutely need to. Once you find a product that's working and you're getting some steady orders, five to 10 a day, reach out to a sourcing agent and get your product sourced. A sourcing agent will be able to get you seven to 14 day shipping worldwide, cheaper product costs, better quality control, custom packaging and branding on your products, and much, much more. I have a sourcing agency, dropshipagent.com, and we do all of that. We ship worldwide, seven to 14 days. We can save you money, especially if you're using Zendrop or CJ Dropshipping. We can save you a bunch of money on your product cost alone. We've been around for four years now. We've shipped out millions of dollars worth of products every single year, and we work with some of the biggest names in the industry. Our only sourcing requirement is five to 10 orders per day. So if you meet that requirement, head to our website, dropshipagent.com, and fill out a free quote request, and we will get back to you within 24 to 48 hours on a quote for your product. I'd say about 85% of people who reach out to us, we can save them money and get them faster shipping times. So it's a win-win. But for now, DSers and AliExpress is a great alternative. So I'm going to click on AliExpress standard shipping, click confirm. Since we already have an AliExpress account and we're logged into it, all we need to do to complete this order is go down here and click on order. And now you're going to have two options basically. You're gonna have the option to order via API, place the order in the DSers app, or you can use a Google Chrome extension that we installed and fulfill the order on AliExpress. But we're going to need to go to AliExpress regardless after this to pay for our order. Right now I'm going to show you how it's done in the DSers app and then I'll make another test order to show you how it's done with the Google Chrome extension. So we have selected that, go over here to confirm, 
costs us ten dollars we're selling this product for thirty dollars so that's twenty dollars profit and now our order is being placed right here successfully placed one order now you can see that it has left the awaiting order tab and moved to the awaiting payment tab so let's click on that and here we go this is our one product that's awaiting payment i'll click on make payment It'll bring us to AliExpress to our orders tab. And here is where you can pay for your product. So you can also view the order details right here, view the customer information, the shipping address, all that stuff just to make sure the customer's address is the same as the customer address on file, but it's going to be the same regardless. So let's go back to here and click on pay now. Now I already have a payment method attached, so I'm going to click on my card and click pay now. And it's that simple. We've now processed the order and now it's being shipped to the customer. It's gonna take a couple days for the order to be processed, packaged, and then get ready to be shipped. And it takes a couple hours for the payment to be verified. So if I go back here to orders tab, you'll see payment being verified. Once the payment is verified, your product will move from awaiting payment to awaiting shipment. And then once it's shipped, it'll move from awaiting shipment to awaiting fulfillment. And then once it's fulfilled and delivered to the customer, it'll be moved from awaiting fulfillment to fulfilled. Once your product is shipped, you will receive a tracking number from AliExpress and you can send that tracking code to your customer via email confirmation. And your customer can then use that tracking number to figure out when their product is going to be delivered. So it's really that simple. The process is very straightforward and it's a lot less complicated than a lot of people think. Let me make another test order really quickly and show you how it's done with the Google Chrome extension. So I'm going to create another order. All right, now we've got our order right there. These are all test orders that I just made myself. I filmed this video yesterday and I used these three orders, but I realized I was using the wrong microphone. So here we are round two. All right, so we have created a new order. I can go to my DSers tab and refresh. And if we go to the open orders, you'll see we now have five and we have one new order awaiting to be ordered. So ignore this big red box right here. Let's go down to shipping method and choose AliExpress standard shipping confirm and now we're going to click on order and we're going to use the google chrome extension this time and you'll see how fast this really works it's similar to how oberlo used to work back in the day before they closed down but it's going to open up a new aliexpress tab input all the customer information and then place the order in aliexpress and you'll see it happen in real time click confirm all right we have this new tab open right here Shipping address is going to be changed. Payment method is going to be your payment method. Boom, and now the order is placed just like that. And then if we refresh and go to our orders tab, you'll see that it popped up right here. And all we need to do now is just go ahead and pay for it. And it's as simple as that. We have just fulfilled two orders and they're going to be delivered to me because I ordered them myself. Probably going to cancel these orders now that I think of it. But anyways, I really hope this video helped you out. I hope you learned a thing or two. I hope you're able to follow along and get your first order fulfilled. Congratulations if you did get your first order. If you haven't had your first order yet, you are now prepared for when that first order does come in. So congratulations to you too. I would love it if you liked this video and subscribed if you haven't already. Thank you once again for watching. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.